Hey, I'm Brent, you're watching Steam Culture. This week we're gonna tell you how they keep the frozen tundra of Lambeau Field from being frozen. Stay tuned. Well, a lot of us have heard of the term the frozen tundra of Lambeau Field and it came about as honestly because it's cold in Green Bay. How cold is it? It's so cold in Green Bay that the lawyers have their hands in their own pockets up there. Well, in 1967, the myth, the legend of the frozen tundra was created. The championship game between the Packers and the Cowboys, temperature was like minus 30, minus 36, and the field actually froze. They actually had some measures in place at the time. Uh, Vince Lombardi, the head coach at that time, had a series of electric coils installed under the field that year, but it was just so cold that it overcame the electric coil. Well, the new solution involves boilers. And that's what we want to tell you about here on Steam Culture. Not actually a steam solution, but a solution involving boilers. Close enough, it's so cool. I wanted to tell you about this. So here's what they do. As you can see, there are many levels to the turf. You got the grass, you've got some levels of dirt below that. You have pea gravel, you have sand. Well, down in the bottom, they have installed PEX tubing, or what you all might know is close to PVC, 43 miles of it strewn all across the field, connected to a manifold system, which is connected to the boiler room where they create hot water. Some people have found use a glycol solution or antifreeze, and they circulate it through those pipes to, at the root level, at create about 55 degrees of temperature, which, as I understand, depending on the temperature, can keep the grass around 40 degrees, which is optimal for the player's cleats to stick and things like that. Well, you know how smart these folks are? They put zone controls in. So the field can literally tell them when I need heat because as you can see here, the sun sets over the field, creates shade, creates cold spots, and they can call for more uh, temperature. So I thought that was really cool. I wanted to tell you about it on Steam Culture. It's not unique just to Lambeau Field. Lots of different fields use it. Arrowhead Stadium, lots of different college fields. If you go Google that, go Google football field heating system, you're going to get all kinds of hits, but you shouldn't do that until you Google us because we have content for you each and every week. We have boiling points, we have steam cultures, so we have all kinds of stuff. Stop by and see us and stop by and see me next Friday. Thanks for joining us.